What's up everyone? Welcome back to another video and then on today's video I want to talk about basic things you should know before trying to work in the cyber security space. So in the cyber security space we have blue teamers, we have red teamers, we have people that work in the security operation center. We have a lot of fields, we have compliance, a lot of fields under cyber security. So pertaining to what I do these are some of the basic things you should know before even trying to apply for any cyber security role so here are some basic things i would like to share with you for you to know before you even apply for any cyber security role so for instance you want to be a SOC analyst i urge you to know how sim solutions work if you want to be a SOC analyst you should look at how sim solutions work how threat intelligence platforms work, how network traffic analyzers work, how IDS works, how IPS, intrusion detection systems and intrusion prevention systems work. So you should know this basic stuff. So that's for of analyst tier one, tier two, threat hunter, whatever, you should know these basic things. And also when it comes to threat hunting, there's no way you need threat hunting and you don't know your core blue team and stuff. So how are you going to actually lay down stuff and investigate issues, solve them, try them, solve those issues and then, you know, do all your incident response. This involves a lot. So what you have to do is before you enter into this space as an entry level person, it's very difficult to know your first job without an experience if you're in the cyber security space. But what happens is, with the substantial knowledge you have, or the, the knowledge you can gather from online and all that, you can speak to things, you can actually pass the interviews, if only you know your stuff. So on the, on the interviews, what you have to do is, Make sure you talk about stuff you can really speak well to. So if, for instance, I'm talking about hacking, that oh, I'm a pen tester, I can do pen testing. You should know that bomb and someone on the team is going to ask you what your recon process is, what you do when you are pivoting and all that. So before you even say, oh, I'm a penetration tester, you should read about all those stuff. Or you, you are aspiring to be a penetration tester. What do you do? You play CTFs, you learn from all the certification bodies you have INE, uh, alien security you have uh, ac council you have offensive security we have a lot of materials out there people are just lazy they don't want to, they want to be spoon fed they don't want to do anything they just want to spoon fed you think you are joking over here bro bro we are never joking over here okay so you keep on grinding you get whatever you want uh, I've been away for a while, yeah, so I decided to do this video today to encourage someone over there who is not getting into cyber security space as he wants to just know your stuff. We have a lot of fields under cyber security, you know, we have information security itself, whereby cyber security falls under information security, so you should know what and what you want to do in cyber security because cyber security. It's a big umbrella having a lot of things under it. Like you have a lot, I say a lot, a lot of roles. So if you want to really work in the cyber security space, just pick what you want to do. Know more about it. Keep grinding, and then keep applying for the jobs. You get one. Just keep applying. Just keep applying. Don't give up because you've applied for about hundreds of them in it. Just keep applying you definitely need the lab one one was going to give you an opportunity one person will give you an opportunity to actually show your skills to actually, to actually prove yourself in whatever you do all right thank you very much